Hello and welcome, I am M Doom. As a Twitch streamer, I have recently simplified all of my overlays and I have been able to do some pretty cool effects with my commands and channel points. I'd like to teach you exactly what I did and show you step by step how to do this yourself. I use an amazing desktop application for all of my effects called Mix It Up. This application will replace all of your needs for any other chatbots that are out there. The first thing you'll want to do is simply navigate to their webpage and download. Link down below. Simply download the application, install, and connect to your Twitch account. Before we can go ahead and do anything really cool on screen, we first need to create a basic overlay within Mix It Up. So let's go ahead and open the application now and learn how to create an overlay and show you how to add it to your streaming software. Once you open up the Mix It Up application, to create a new overlay, we're going to click the gear icon in the upper right to go to settings. On the left, you'll find the overlays menu. Once you click that, you'll see I already have one currently, but now we can go ahead and create our own. You can name your new overlay whatever you would like. We're going to call ours Demo Overlay. I will click Add, and there you go. Here is the URL for our new overlay. And this now creates an empty overlay that we'll be able to do anything with. We're going to go ahead and click this button right here to copy this URL to our clipboard. And now we'll be ready to add this to whatever streaming software we happen to be using. And for me, that streaming platform happens to be OBS Studio as my software of choice. Now I have created a new empty scene called Demo Scene. And now we want to add that overlay that we just created as a new source to this demo scene. We start by clicking the plus sign in the lower left corner, and we are going to be adding a browser source. You will want to click on Create New to create a new source. I'm going to go ahead and call mine Mix It Up Overlay. Once you do that, click OK and you should get a pop-up that looks like this. Now the first thing we're going to do is replace the text in the URL box of what is on our clipboard of our new overlay URL. I want my overlay to fill my entire canvas, so I set mine to 1080p, which is 1920 by 1080p. Now I always click the control audio via OBS because I like to control my audio sources through the built-in audio mixer. Go ahead and scroll down, and I always choose shut down source when not visible, as well as refresh browser when scene becomes active. And go ahead and click OK, and you'll see our overlay fills our entire canvas within our scene. And that's it! We have successfully created a new default overlay to use throughout the Mix It Up application, and we have added it to OBS Studio to use for our next live stream. Stay tuned for our next videos where we will go into exploring how to do some custom commands with some pretty cool animation effects that will show up on this new overlay that we created. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to click that like and subscribe button. Thank you.